Welcome back gamers to another Counter Strike video. Okay, I didn't do that like Seb the Gamer would do it, but that is in fact because I'm not him. I am actually... Oh, I didn't see that guy in time anyways. I am in fact the real Brock and Seb the Gamer just allowed me to make a video on his channel. So that's what I'm doing right now. And I'll be playing a bit of deathmatch with the... Oh! M4A4? I, I used to play with the M4A1S, but since that got nerfed a few months ago, I thought that uh, that would be the perfect time for me to actually try to learn the M4A4, since it does have a way different spray pattern than the M4A1S, and the M4A1S is way easier to control. Wow, I panicked on that one. I was so sure I got the guy on the first few hits. There was so much blood coming out from him anyways, so uh, apparently not though. So uh, he was quite close at just killing me with the knife, and that would have been terrible. So anyways, like I was saying, the M4A1S got nerfed like 2-3 to three months ago. And since it got nerfed, um, and I always wanted to actually learn how to play with the M4A4, I thought that that would be a perfect time for me to st actually start using it. Uh, it got nerfed on both uh, armor penetration and uh, fire rate, uh, firing rate of the gun. So it doesn't shoot as many rounds per minute as it used to do. Um, and it also holds way less bullets than, uh, than the M4A4. So with the M4A1S you can only have 20 bullets in one magazine. While with the M4A4, you can actually have 30 bullets. So that that's quite a difference uh, between the amount of uh, bullets and the shots that you will be able to fire. And also, it does have like an extra magazine or so. So, so you just in all you just have way more bullets. Um, but it's a bit more complicated to control the, the, the spray of the M4A4. The recoil is harder to control and also the spray pattern is uh, it's bigger and more difficult to learn. But I still think worth it. Nice. And two headshots. Well, it's uh, I'm obvious, obviously I'm not playing as well as I would if I were just playing without talking. Because I also have a bit on of, a bit of my focus on making some good conversation with you guys, and that was a bad time for me to reload. That's also a bad habit, reloading when you don't necessarily have to. Um, for instance, now I only used three bullets, so it wouldn't really make sense to reload at the moment unless I know that I'm safe, which you never really do in deathmatch. Because I, I still have 27 bullets to use, right? And that should be more than enough to get a few kills. Okay, so I'm just gonna reload, even though I still had 14 bullets left. That's also probably because I'm used to using the M4A1S. So with that you only have 20 bullets, and that means that every time you shoot, you spend a lot of your bullets and you have to reload quite often, um, or you'll end up without any bullets. Oh, someone else took that guy, he just saved me. 13 HP left. That's pretty bad. Okay, that guy was shooting at me, and I think he was probably using a light machine gun or something like that, and he didn't actually hit me, not even once. Oh. Well. Too many targets to just spawn next to, it kinda sucks. Got a bit confused on which one to choose. Also because I saw, saw that the first one was actually a bot. I guess I killed the bot now. Wow. Is the bot... A yeah, the bot is actually a bot. It's not just someone named bot like you often see in games. Okay. Okay, there's a few coming. Ah. Oh. Oh, someone just spawned in there. Let's see if... Oh! Can knife him. Well, that's not gonna happen when someone is walking down from the right as well. And the... 
guy from the spawn peaks just when the guy from the right approaches me as well. So that was just some uh, bad timing. Okay, it looks like there's someone in the apartments. Let's go check that out. Okay. Ah, oh, what a shame. Wow, that was but Adrian getting two of us. Oh, he's dominating me. And he's not even the best player. Nice. That's why some sometimes the spawn invulnerability is just stupid. And that's one of the things I'm actually bad at playing deathmatch because I never I I never wait. While I'm, I have the invulnerability, I just go straight away. I move straight away, just because I hate standing around. I just want to want to find the action, you know. So if it were up to me, I would just remove that altogether, and we would all be playing without the vulnerability. Oh, someone hit from underground! Oh, so many two and three hits. Sucks. Ah, oh, he just got taken down. That would have been an easy knife kill, though. Wow, that was some bad spray control. Had to take a break from spraying just to get that guy. Let's see if we can find someone. Well, looks like we like sleep. Yeah, he found us first. So that's no fun. Why is that guy shooting me in the back? That was one of my teammates. Okay, someone is in the pit. Let's see if we can knife him. If he's still there. Looks like he ran away. Where are they at? 84. Come on. Oh. That other CT just uh, got ahead of me and someone came out of construction. I didn't see that because I was just busy looking at the scoreboard. Let's go, banana. I think there's gotta be someone down here. Some terrorist. Uh, apparently not. Oh, maybe apartment's done. Oh, sh one just around the corner. Wow, did he just no scope me from behind? Okay, one of the cheese got ahead of me now. Okay, I guess you're not gonna get a nice kill in this video though. Wow, he could still see me I guess. Okay, well that's gonna be it for this video. No knife kills and I didn't even finish in one of the top three positions. I actually recorded a video before but then I found out that I didn't press the record button. So that's a shame but I finished in second position on that one. So that would have been more fun I guess for you guys to watch. Well I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to subscribe to Seb the Gamer because he makes awesome videos. And also you can go to my channel to check out my stuff and hopefully you like what you see and you can subscribe to me as well. So thanks for watching guys. Bye. I must admit though, the real Broke's intro, well his interpretation of my intro, that was funny. Before this video ends, I just want to let you ga gamers know that this video could possibly start a brand new series on my YouTube channel where we where another youtuber and myself 
swap roles. So I create a video for that YouTuber while that YouTuber creates a video for my channel. Now, if you gamers want to see more of this with other guests such as BMAX or hopefully Dreyark and some other YouTubers that I have not mentioned yet because they're still a surprise, you know, secret secrets. No, they're not PewDiePie, not yet at least. Um, <laughs> Um, just let me know in the comment sections below and I'll make sure that I'll, you know, contact them, show them that you guys want, want to see them and yeah. So I hope you gamers did enjoy this video. Many thanks for, um, the real broke for actually, you know, letting me do this with him. I think it was actually his idea and I thought it was such a great idea that I might actually steal it and use it for my channel. Um, sorry, sorry, broke. Love you, bro. Yeah, um, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, also, if you want to see the video that I made for his channel, it's on the screen right now. Uh, make sure you go check it out. It's practically, yeah, I won't spoil it for you. It's getting some crazy views already. Um, and I, and I, it's probably the most popular video that I have uh, that I actually made. I'm not saying this to be, I'm, not, I'm trying to be as modest as possible, but it's, it's a pretty good video. And I might actually do something similar for this channel, but let me know, gamers. So I hope you gamers enjoyed. Make sure you smash that sub uh, subscribe button. Make sure you also go subscribe to Real Broke. He would like to get to 1,000 subs as soon as possible. So let's get him to that because I know he can do it. So I hope you gamers enjoyed, and I'll see you in the very next video. Goodbye, and don't forget, gamers, to keep on gaming.